Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. If we talk about the requirement of Indian Navy's 111 NUH that is Naval Utility Helicopter, it has been a failure under the strategic partnership route and recently Ministry of Defense has decided to fulfill this requirement via indigenous route which means it paves the way for HAL's advanced light helicopter. The good news is that HL has reported today that the first flight of advanced light helicopter wheeled version with segmented MRV main rotor blades and MRH main rotor head in pre-cone configuration was carried out in Bengaluru. The two segment main rotor blades and pre-cone configuration of main rotor head are developed to address the stringent stowage dimension requirement as specified by Indian Navy. HAL has already proven the tail boom folding. These tests will ensure that ALH will be able to fulfill the requirement and quality parameters laid for NUH by Indian Navy. Another critical trial for ALH Mark III was conducted back in April 2020 to demonstrate the deck operational capabilities that include landing on deck, folding of blades, and storing the helicopter inside the onboard hangar. The ship-borne trial was conducted off Chennai coast in collaboration with Indian Coast Guard. It also covered maintenance activities inside the hangar and on the deck and hot refueling with engines running on the deck. These trials have now proven the capabilities of LS Dhruv. With successful demonstration of these capabilities like great folding, stowage, the helicopter is now ready to be fielded for operation. If you closely observe the blades of HAL Dhruv, only the side blades need to be folded, which moves backward. The blades at the front and back remains at the original position. Now many of you would be thinking if the manual folding of blades is so complex, why not make the entire system automatic? The automatic blade folding system is a complex electrohydraulic mechanism, which further adds weight to the helicopter. It is also very difficult to build small hingeless rotor system into LH. Auto folding is a requirement for larger naval helicopters such as Sea King MK42B, Merlin HM, MK2, or CH148 Cyclone. Their large, heavy blades cannot be manhandled without serious risk of damage to men or machine because the rotor diameter often extends beyond the ship deck edge. The helicopter in 5 to 5.5 ton categories mostly have a manual blade folding system and do not accommodate fully automatic blade folding. The automatic blade folding was also not part of the 5 ton naval utility helicopter NUH requirement. Now back in October 2021, Indian Navy and HL has done an extensive review of NUH requirement. Navy has asked for 60 NUH based on ALH as per by India IDDM indigenously designed, developed and manufactured root of defense equation process 2020. The new NUH will be a variant of ALH and LUH modified for ship based operation based on Navy's requirement. HL is now working on detailed project report covering helicopter configuration and overall cost and will be submitting the details to MOD soon. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.